differences between Baroque and modern. Um, the most noticeable one is probably the chin rest. There's no chin rest on the Baroque violin. Um, also, the fingerboard is a lot shorter and it's flatter. The bridge is also flatter and it's a little bit wider too, so it, it feels different to have your hand around it. And um, the sound, uh, the, the slope of the fingerboard actually changes the sound in comparison to the modern violin because this fingerboard is almost parallel to the violin, whereas on the modern instrument it slopes down much more. So here, since it's almost parallel, there's a lot less pressure on the bridge and the sound post. Um, so since there's not a whole lot of pressure there, the sound is more mellow and dark, but on modern violin, um, with the extra pressure from the strings, um, it, it has a much more bright, intense kind of sound. The strings we use are gut strings, and I really like playing on gut strings. They just have a, a darker sound to them, um, and they, they respond really well. Uh, the bow is also a little different. It's curved and it feels very light and bouncy, kind of, when you play it. Um, it really lends itself well to expression within every single note. It's very easy to make changes within a note. You can change the bow pressure and speed very quickly, and since you're not doing as much um, expressive techniques with your left hand as far as vibrato, um, it's really important to be able to use the bow uh, to add expression to the music.